Well, that was great. Apart from the crystal skull sending out its invisible rays of bullshit, I think that might be my best ever sexual experience. Okay, I think we have to have a talk about the whole thing. I'm sorry, the whole... The whole sexual experience. I have to say, that was very disappointing. Oh, right. I don't mean to be rude, but is that the kind of thing you usually do? Well, I I suppose in general... What exactly did I do wrong? Well, it was better than with Jeremy, though. With Jeremy, I had to stop him in the middle. You stopped Jeremy in the middle? I'm sorry, is this weird for you? Do you want to know? I do... a, a bit. He's like a red setter bounding after a tennis ball. You're like a captain solemnly going down with his ship. Oh, well, well, that's good to know. But we can try again, as long as you're prepared for me to tell you exactly what to do. That could be a good system. OK, now, I'm going to take your hand and put it there. You OK with that? Yeah. Now, I want you to move your hand around like this. You can do that, right? It's easy. Not a problem. Is this humiliating? It is a bit humiliating. I guess the upside is that what I was doing before was humiliating in a way I wasn't even aware of. Okay, good. Let's begin the sex. I'll drive. Oh my god, this is brilliant! I'm a sex robot servicing the one. I always wondered what my fetish was, and it seems what truly turns me on is being basically absent for most of the sex act. Hello, hello? Room for one more? No. What? Managed to get a couple of days off around the weekend, so I thought I'd tag along. But... This is outrageous. This is contagious. Yeah. Maybe a tattoo on my chest, but of my face.